Do you want the other one? 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 Today we're going to talk about digital ownership. Yeah. Wow. So let me ask the first question here. One second. We'll screen. Yes. There we go. Thank you very much. The first question is that: Do you own your social media posts? Like you post every day on Facebook, on Instagram, and stuff. Do you own it? No. No. Meta. No. Right. So and also, do you own your Facebook and Instagram account? For example, no. Matt, yeah. you have 1,000 followers. Rim, 2,000. Sam, like nearly 5,000. Do you actually own your followers? No. No. You never own it. For example, this is the very famous celebrity, Donald Trump. Like, he has like nearly 90 million followers on Twitter. But then what happened to his, his account on Twitter? Ben. Cancel. Yeah. It's suspended. And you, your accounts can be anytime as well. So that's why, that's the reason why there are a lot of middlemen, they are trying to control you. What are these? Let answer me. What's this? Meta. Facebook. What's this? Instagram. LinkedIn. TikTok. Twitter. YouTube. Everything here is this middleman. It's the platform that only all of your posts, all of your followers, and all of your data. That's why we need blockchain. Blockchain is a technology that you can actually own your stuff online. And your stuff online is called the digital assets, which is called the, the NFT. I'll explain about that later. So about how you can control your digital asset, this is our product, it's called Oslis. And this is the wallet, the thing that will, you will need to actually store all of your assets online. You can try it, but later. And also we have the platform. This is the whole marketplace. Everything digital assets on here, can be sell, can be sold, can be bought, and you can interact with it. The future of NFTs will be very fascinating. You know about the creator economy, right? In the creator economy, you can actually create your own digital product that you can sell for money. For example, for now, you sell a lot of physical product, like we, we talk about the physical product a lot, but then we, how about that is a digital product? For example, in this, this is called the first 5,000 days by people. There are 5,000 image, 5,000 arts by this artist. Can you guess how, what is the price of this as an NFT? Take a guess. 5,000. One million. One bitcoin. One bitcoin. What else? One bitcoin is around like 17,000 uh, right now. So this one costs $69 million. Whoa. And you can also create that kind of stuff too. So everyone in the future will have a personal brand to build your business. So in order to dominate your world, you have to dominate your world and control your asset. Thank you very much. Thank you. I have a question. I have a question. Before question, please try scan this code and then if. Once you download this, you are a blockchain user. You are oh. stepping into the new world. Try it. Nice. It's all available on App Store and on Google Play. Yeah, me yeah. first, me first. I have a question. Uh, so back to the example of the 5,000 <laughs> pictures with 69 million. What's the value of that picture that people must buy it with that amount of money? That's the first one. And the second one is about what's the value behind NFTs and uh, and then, and then, um, how to say it's, uh, crypto, crypto, crypto. that uh, people must pay a lot of money for it. Right. So this one is actually a, an auction. You know what auction is, right? Yeah. So people trying to push the price further and further. And this is a very famous mm -hmm. NFT because it's one of the first NFTs ever made in, in the world. Um, the reason why it's so high in price, because back last year, NFT was so high at that time. And then the reason why people are so believing in it, because you can actually own, because every transactions online are stored and are very transparent. That's the reason why it's, you cannot search for the activities online on Facebook if Facebook does not let you to. That's why the, the blockchain thing is different. 
and also you talk about like uh, what the the price behind it, right? It's this is just real money, real yeah, money. Yeah, but I mean, why people must pay that money for that? They feature? must. They for must. What? They must not. Yes, they don't that's have an to. auction. They, this that's an auction. Uh-huh. That's your choice. That's their their choice, and actually they're supposed. So I guess profit. people buy it because they want to sell it with a higher price yeah. for the next one. Depends. Yeah, have you heard about collectibles? Um, one more thing about uh, what he said. Um, you collect the art, and then you hang it at home. Like billionaires do that. Um, so, so that's the reason why they buy it and then they store it. Um, one more question, please, from from Matthew. Oh, we got time. Actually, we're gonna have to. Okay. Close out on time. Yeah. So have a lot of time on the bus to talk. Yeah. So we'll talk about EFTs. Yeah. But great job. Let's hear it. Yeah. Subscribe to Bern.id. Dan jangan lupa untuk mengunduh Pranala App. Untuk video terbaru, kamu bisa klik video di kanan atas. Dan untuk video rekomendasi, bisa klik video di kanan bawah. Terima kasih.